Well, hi everybody and welcome. Thank you all for being here. Good evening. We are live, I think, and I've got sound. Right? I got a Mr. Wellington chewing a trachea right here. He's decided he needed to get one that was hidden and is helping himself. You gonna come over here? You gonna get in your bed? I'll turn on Orson Vision. You weren't promised for this evening, boy, but but I'll put you to work. I'll do it. I'll freaking do it. Hello, Sabretooth. How are you? I said 7.15 in the, in the, on the YouTube thing. And then I sat down and I was like, well, it ain't 7.15, but I'm going to go anyway. So, oh my God, he's in his, oh my God. <laughs> That's the best. Good evening. Hello, C and Pep. Hello, Top 5 Bleep Bloop. Cadis, hello. Jay, good evening. The sun goes down and the hoodlums come out. Listen, it makes more sense for hoodlums to come out at night, okay? You ain't hoodlums if you getting up at bright and early every morning. Mm, let's try the mushroom tea. That's quite tasty, actually. Yum. Awesome be bossin'? Where'd you go, boy? Now you just... Now you just laid straight out, boy. Hello, Raging Calm, MC Dre. Yeah, oh, he is working on it, man. Alright, y'all. Mushroom tea is actually really good. It's got a little spice to it. A little spicy spice. <sighs> no, I like it, though. It's uh, it's a good evening drink. Raging Calm eating his plain peanut butter. You and Orson be Barson here. <laughs> so silly. Oh, of course. Now he gets up. Of course, of course. He gets up and leaves. Of course he does. Of course he does. Mmm. Yep. He making progress on the trachea. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. Not that kind of mushroom tea. Different kind of mushroom tea. Um, this one, where's my thing that there? The mushrooms in this tea are which ones? Lion's mane, reishi, and ashwagandha. Is that a mushroom? I don't recognize it, but it's in there. It's definitely in there. Ashwagandha for stress support. I like that. Lion's Mane. Focus. I could always use focus when gaming. And Reishi is a mood boost. Mushrooms. There are so many mushrooms out there. And they are actually discovering more all the time. Which is kind of crazy to think about. And they are so good for us. Uh, as many as there are out there that will kill you for eating them. Um, uh, or cause you to ascend to another level of reality um there are also lots of mushrooms out there that are just really good for your health and your brain and i got a a uh, mushroom forager box that i ordered honest to god like last year in october or something but it has been back it's been like things have been out of stock things have been deliveries uh, supply chains have been broken and i only just now got it um, so I wanted to try the stuff in it, and what was most appropriate 
for the the stream. But there was like there was all kinds of stuff. Actually, there was a chocolate bar. I might go get that and sample it as well. That's a good idea. I'll do that in a minute. The tea is good, but I was like, a nice tea is 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 a good. It's a good option, and I wasn't really sure what to expect, but I like it. Well, hi, RJ City. Nice to see you. Oh, oh I need to turn my controller on, because I play with a controller. No, no, I said ascend. I said ascend. I can hear Nixie and Triton barking their heads off. Ashwagandha is an evergreen bush. Interesting! Well, it's also in this tea. Hmm. I can almost taste that. <laughs> in a good way. It's good! Oh no, I remember where I'm at. Oh no. I'm not doing good. This is bad. Okay, hold on. I need to get rid of some stuff. No, this is symbol multiple. I think you watched the one I was talking about there for a while, MC, which was the Fantastic Fungi uh, documentary. I think it's literally just called Fantastic Fungi. 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 Whatever you want to call it. I don't care. but it's amazing. How many amazing things there are out there that like, that they've discovered mushrooms really help us with? Like, all kinds of stuff. It's kind of wild. They've evolved alongside with us. It's natural for them to help us. And also try to kill us. Well, there's, there's both. You know? There's both. Doing over there, Orson B. Borson. Loco! Hello! Good evening. Nice to see you. I don't know how to get into this place right here. Is it this way? It's gotta be. Millie! How's it going, Millie? I am so excited for the New Horizon to come out, you guys. Like, so, so, so excited. Oh, no, I've made a mistake. I made a mistake. Yeah. I can't. Are you kidding me? I can't sliss a rat. Why can't I sliss the rat? I can shoot the rat. Daggum it. I'll do it, too. Yeah, follow the creases. Follow the creases. You can do it. Yes! I swear to God, you just... Honestly, just follow the creases, man. You just follow the creases, you ain't got nothing to worry about. Oh. Are you? Oh, damn, I didn't see homie there. Yeehaw! Maybe I should try stealth as well. Like, I don't really go stealth anymore, and, and maybe I should. You know, maybe that'd be smart. Oh, what are you doing? That's not stealth. Let me go stealth here. Leaps out of the bushes. Idiot. You idiot. You're an idiot. I didn't even really mean to freeze him, but okay. All right, got it. Nope, that's bad. Spay it, spay it. 
Hello. Alright. Let's make them come to me. Let's make them come to me. We can do that. Oh yeah, because we got bad boy out here. I freaking knew it. This is not good. Where? Oh, hello. Hello. Eek. 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 Alright, you, I can fight by yourself. Okay, I can do that. I can handle you. You son of a bitch. Ah, that's a rock, bruh. Oh, I don't need you on my ass, too, homie. Uh. Alright, I was not prepared for this. I was not prepared for this. to run away. That's what I always say. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my lord. Oh, my lord. Do that again, he's dead. Just gotta do that again. Oh, be careful, he's coming. Oh, oh my god, I did it. Now, shoot. Bleed. Better not be freaking healing. That's all I'm gonna say. Oh! Nope. What the heck? Okay, I was about to be like, why is he not dead? Okay, now with that jerk face dead. Oh, hello, Bianca. Oh boy, why did that? Why? Oh my god. Everything, everything can be set on fire. Pretty much, except the things that use fire and they can't be set on fire. Okay, I think I did, I think I did it. I should be able to pick off whatever's left. Yep, you're dead. Hello. Look at this fire archer battle. Woohoo! Oh, you bastards! That's that was a hit. I don't care what anybody says. Got him. Oh, you. Get it. Oh my god. Can't hit shit. Can't see him. This is it for you. Whatever. Don't don't be talking shit. There. That's what 
you know, like, who sits over there and talks smack like that when you have gotten every one of your buddies has been murdered, and the snow's got a bite out here. Uh, jerk face is a great insult. Okay. Do you ever look at someone and just could tell by their face? <laughs> no. I mean, sometimes. Sometimes you can tell by someone's expression, which is their face, of course. Not necessarily the way they look, but their expression, or the way they are looking, I'm like, you seem like a bit of a jerk. Like, I think drill sergeants always go for kind of a perpetual jerk face. Why have they been uncovering right? here? Especially while working. You're yelling only her name, Ty Five. That's what's even funnier about it. sound good. I need to save. Like, soon. And I don't like all these noises. It's scary. I'm scared. Hello? Another explosion. Cultus and the Deathbringer. Great. Oh yeah, I remember Another these things. Oh my god. Has to be one of the Deathbringers all we talked about. I mean, I'll never get into that tower. Unless I destroy that thing first. Yeah, but let's get up and kill the snipers first. over there. Turn your back. I have an idea. That's right. Go investigate that rock, sir. Uh-huh. <laughs> that wasn't even where I threw it. All right. You did. Oh, Jesus. All right. Way over here.
Oh boy. That's right, come on over here. Yeah! And now this guy's back, of course. But we're gonna wait for him to go. Cause it's gonna give me, it's gonna really help me. Like even this guy, what's this guy doing? I gotta do something about that. Shoot. Haven't you got anything better to do? Shoot. Oh wait, you know what I can do? Can't hit him. Hold on. Come here. Someone's out there killing us! Focus. It stopped working. I've disabled his focus. The rest is up to you. I'll handle it. Oh, steam's blasting out. I wonder if those are weak points. Gotta be. I also don't have many healing potions to be fighting this freaking thing. Why can't I do that? As soon as he walks that way, I'm gonna go because I finally have an opening. I think. I think I managed to blow that guy up and nobody noticed. Finally. Go on. Go go go! Climb. Oh, I should have done strike from above. Oh! A Mr. Wellington. You handsome boy. Mr. Wellington. Oh, jeez. Let's see what you 
He lives, me. What the hell was that? Mm. Hades? Hey! Ooh, what's that? My mysterious Whoa. stranger! Did you see that? No answer, huh? Figures. Those are some I badass upgrades. I need to find a way inside the tower. Mm. Yeah, these are actually really good. I need. I need my mushroom chocolate. I want to try it. Looks tight, but I can squeeze through. Hold for identity scan. Nothing. Genetic oh! profile confirmed. Entry authorized. Greetings, Dr. Sobek. Oh, we yeah! Step inside. Like what? Oh man! How are her hands not numb? Some the same way. Three hundred fifty-five thousand five hundred. How many years is that? Wait, wait, wait! Three hundred and fifty thousand. That's hundreds of years ago. What's going on? Raging Calm said, how are her hands not numb? And I was going to say, the same way that uh, Wim Hof's hands and feet don't go numb and he doesn't get frostbite when he walks out in the, you know, pouring snow in the mountain, barefoot with nothing but, like, underwear and a hat on. I, it's beyond me. But ever since he's been able to do that, I can justify it in video games. I'm like, well, sometimes people can do that. I couldn't do that. I think I'd die. If I think I'd die. Listen, y'all. Ice baths and ice showers are brutal for me. Okay? I'm not built for the cold. But I would often say, if you were really, really, really sore, and you didn't think anything else would help, an ice bath will probably fix it. Because they do. They are no joke. And they work great. But man, I hate them. But it works really good for some people. How many... Yeah, I was saying, how many years is 355,500? 355,000. Right? Is that what it was? We're getting a lot of years. By CM's pep, CM Pep's calculations, 172. Did Bloop Bloop just answer a question without knowing, or yeah, without knowing the question? Because that's funny. Calls use polyphasic entangled waveforms, quantum encryption, black court stuff, way beyond military grade. That's what you demanded. So that's what we delivered. You don't code something you can't crack. All we need is a backdoor. Upload the latest service pack update and the problem goes away. 
You specifically forbade us from leaving anything resembling a backdoor in code. Every protocol to Blackcourt standard. Your words. Look, if you need me to fudge some projections, it's nothing we haven't done before. I don't need fudged projections. I need a way to reassert control over the Hearts team or Swarm. Yeah. I don't know what to tell you, Ted. You're asking the impossible. So, codes. They needed codes of some kind to control the machines. Yep. But they got out of control. Yep. Sounds bad. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. Already. Gotta disassemble these into shards. First of all, skills. Hmm. Or I wait. Ooh, I wait. Can I get this one? Might be able to trade in a set for something. Deathbringer. I feel like there's probably a metal band named Deathbringer. If I were to guess. A Deathbringer. Deathbringer. Or a statue of one, anyway. A machine built to kill. And they honored it? Welcome to Feral Automated Solutions, where all the problems of tomorrow are being solved today. With over 25,000 human employees based in nations and corporate holdings across the globe, Pharaoh leads the world in every sector of self-sustaining, fully automated technology. From revolutionary consumer products close to home, like the Pharaoh Focus, to the dynamic chariot line of peacekeeping robots halting bloodshed in conflict zones across the globe, Pharaoh remains committed to making the future smarter, brighter, safer, and always surprising. Pharaoh Automated Solutions. For every problem of life, a smart solution. So they made the focus. 25,000 people? That's bigger than a tribe. So 
They made machines and devices. I guess those things were common in their world. Jesus. Reception log. Wait, what? Welcome to Feral Automate. Oh, cool. This is creepy. What I forgive you, Blue. What like were they what? doing here? These offer this massive context. Wait. A group of people not unlike a tribe. And they made machines. Yeah, go on. I've uploaded some data files to your focus. They'll help you understand. A group of people not unlike a tribe. That's so wild to think about, man. Now I know this must seem like a bizarre change in direction. I mean, we're Faro Automated Solutions, right? Number one robotics firm in the world. Why would we clear our production slate to fabricate human-operated vehicles and weapon systems, the relics of the past? All I can say at this juncture is... Trust me. We will be exploiting a massive, uh, growth opportunity by retooling and reallocating capacity according to my plan. So I will need revised projections of mass fabrication velocity across every pipeline within 36 hours. So they were making machines, but then they stopped to make other kinds of weapons? Why? The air. There's no smell to it. Not even old death. Nothing natural. Another cave in. But I could get through. Jumpy. <laughs> oh, oh I can use that as a ramp to get back up. What? where I was supposed to go then. This boy is exhausted. I know this boy is exhausted. Yeah, yeah, it's my hand. The cutest little butt. The cutest little butt. Oh, don't leave. He'll be back. He'll be back. I'm sure of it. Hey, what's up here? Wait. Left of it. No, no. But we gotta see what else is down here. We ain't going up right away. No, 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 no.
It's crazy if this is like headquarters of the place. Oh, people were angry at Faro, at the corporation. They blamed this place for something. Something bad. Yeah, for losing control of the machines that they were building and causing a catastrophic uh, destruction of civilization. Hollow projectors, oh boy. The FSP-5 Kopesh provides a one-size-fits-all solution to main battle force capability. The Metamaterial area. construction delivers unmatched recoil dampening, allowing you to field any weapon package that conforms to your budget needs and conflict resolution profile. Patented biomass conversion systems allow extended emergency operations with minimal environmental impact. Multilinear target processing provides simultaneous real-time threat analysis and legal review for autonomous domestic operations. Or control can be slaved to the swarm's neural network for weapons-free force application. Either way, when it's time to call out the big guns, it's time to call Kopesh. The Deathbringer. Yep. So this was the heavy hitter. Main battle force indeed. The BOR-7 Horus. Imagine your complete engagement ecosystem comprehensively managed by a high-speed learning machine network. Whether your need is to replace battlefield losses or intensify force projection, the Horus' onboard manufacturing capabilities mean you'll never get stuck waiting for the next arms delivery. That's kind of Simply horrifying. Simply redefine your force parameters, and the Horus will fabricate additional units to fill the ranks for an affordable per-unit licensing fee. Meanwhile, the biomass conversion systems of other chariot line models allow them to keep the Horus fueled, repaired, and ready. Extend- Oh, no! But I want to hear it. Dang it! Boo. Okay, fine. I'm gonna sit real still. The BOR-7 Horus. Imagine your complete engagement ecosystem comprehensively managed by a high-speed learning machine network. Whether your need is to replace battlefield losses or intensify force projection, the Horus' onboard manufacturing capabilities mean you'll never get stuck waiting for the next arms delivery. Simply redefine your force parameters, and the Horus will fabricate additional units to fill the ranks for an affordable per-unit licensing fee. Meanwhile, the biomass conversion systems of other chariot line models allow them to keep the Horus fueled, repaired, and ready, extending its operational tolerances beyond that of any competing Titan-class platform. That's crazy. That's the Horus advantage. Always regulating, always ready. The future mm -hmm. of automated warfare made real today. I automated so devil. So these were Faro machines too. Manufacturing capabilities. Abilities. They can make more of themselves. Then how would you ever stop them? Exactly! Idiot! Wouldn't you be like, idiots? Idiots? What did you expect? What did you expect? Tamakan says, this: the gradual way this game reveals the backstory is maybe my favorite thing about it. Yes. And I'm with you, Ty5. It's been so long, I do not actually remember it. And that's crazy because I loved it and I played it seriously. I played it on stream and I it's been so long I actually can't remember but as I play it I'm like oh yeah oh yeah like it's so good all over again. The ACA-3 Scarab combines conventional and information warfare capabilities in one package designed for high-speed all-terrain reconnaissance. It boasts the world's highest survivability rating of any scout class autonomous agent. Maybe it's the Scarab's emergency biomass conversion systems that ensure it always makes it back to base, even if fuel supply lines have been interdicted. Or maybe it's the Scarab's ability to slave enemy robots oh, to its my own God. network. Now that's force multiplication. Add a prehensile manipulator arm that can handle a host of functions. From 360 degree less lethal riot management to surgical oh, repairs wow. of allied chariot line models. And you've got the workhorse of any cutting edge peacekeeping fleet. 
the corruptor. Yeah. Slave enemy robots to its own network. Uh huh. It sounds like it's talking about how it corrupts machines. Yep. Amazing. Thank you for that. See, didn't need to go in that room, but I'm glad that I did. I think I went here. That's there. We went there. We got that. Okay, I think we can go up now. I think it's safe to go up now. Yes. <laughs> Emma! I'm so glad you joined. It's still early, Emma. I haven't even had my first break, so... It's all good. I'm sorry notifications are weird. Sometimes I recommend turning them off and then trying to turn them back on. And make sure you have the not just the bell, the bell. There's like the bell with the long way up. Should, should not be this complicated, YouTube. Not making this easy, Dr. Sobek. But yeah. That's my one one real complaint I have currently with YouTube. Here. Guess I can too. My my only real like issue currently is that notifications suck and that affects my numbers. I feel like if notifications were better, the numbers would be better. Sometimes when my numbers are low, I'm like, oh, sad. But then I'm like, wait, what if it's just YouTube? <laughs> like, dang, like that kind of sucks, you know? Oh, Lord have mercy. All right, what's that? Since the began when they engaged in unauthorized offensive operations against robots and human personnel of the Hearts Timor Energy Combine. Now, I wish that I could relate that the crisis has been exaggerated, but it's not. The peacekeepers have not responded to stand down coats, and by all signs, they appear to be replicating at a precipitous rate. Now, what I can promise you can absolutely assure you is that I am already devoting every possible resource towards reaching a speedy conclusion to yeah. this issue. So when you hear yeah. the bad talk about us against this company in the days, maybe weeks to come, just bear in mind that we will get past this. And a day's coming when none of this will matter. Right. Peacekeepers. That's what they called their machines. Yeah. They were built for war. Right. Not peace. So messed up, dude. Forget about traveling light. Even Aloy can realize this is so, like, not. Jesus. I don't like the climbing in this game. Hey, wait, is there something up here? Wait a minute. I found a secret. I found a secret, I found a secret. Or wait, did I find it? No, the secret is down. The secret is down. The secret is down. The first one was the secret. Okay, let's go here. Or is it even a secret? It's freezing out here. Secret. Or do we, what? Oh. I can climb inside or outside. I see. I just I feel like we do a lot of amazing things with computers and technology. I don't understand why setting notifications for a YouTube channel is so difficult. But then again, I don't know anything about coding or websites and you know anything I don't know anything about that stuff I just know that it's it's possible like it seems like out there people are doing really amazing things with computers and technology so that if I was a bazillion dollar co corporation it seems like I would just you know hire some of those people could be like could you help me like see you doing these amazing things over here with these computers and technology could you come do that over here because we've got some real problems that need uh, fixing it's just like that's what I'm like is that asking like I 
Is it asking so much? I just, I feel like it's not, but then it's like it never gets done. It's like it never improves. Where the hell do you go? Huh? Whack. Chop through anything here? Yeah. Aha! Whee! God, talk about just ballsy. Got too much already. Dang, wait, what are you missing? Huh, potions. Well, they're trying to give me potions, it's just... I need herbs. But that's the thing, you don't get herbs and berries inside these places. That's kind of messed up, huh? Mushroom tea is gone, y'all. It was delicious. I'm gonna get some mushroom chocolate. See what that's all about. Oh, there it is. Way up. All it takes is a few good handholds. All right, made it. Woo! Wonder what we'll find. Wonder what we'll find. Wonder what we'll find. Whee! All data has been erased from this device. Do you wish to deploy other privileges to recover purge data? Yes. Oh yes, I believe I do. I do. A file has been recovered. What? What file? Where? Listen. Hey! Elizabeth, good to, uh... Whoa. It's been years. Where's your legal team, Ted? No need. I dropped all look 18 like me. lawsuits the moment you landed. I assume your daddy confirms this. Sort of. Oh well, my god, she does! to be interesting. Perhaps we could have <gasps> lunch. Whoa! Right in, Wicked! You know, get reacquainted. I know you, Ted. You screwed something up, something big, or you wouldn't have eaten the crow necessary to get me here. So, spit it out. There's... a glitch in the chariot line. Your killer robots? Uh-huh. Peacekeepers, yes. Those. No, not peacekeepers. So shut them down. <laughs> Obviously, Liz, we would, if we could. They're not responding. Are you telling me a swarm has gone rogue, Ted? It's worse than that. <sighs> Show me the data, then. And I'll take that lunch. Alone. Wow. Ted Faro brought Elizabeth Sobek here. To ask for help. Each other. He needed her help. Oh, give me. This isn't a glitch. It's a catastrophe. 2064. It's bad. Bad? Jesus, Liz. It's not bad, Ted. It's apocalyptic. Yeah. You built a line of killer robots. Peacekeepers. No. That consume biomass as fuel. Yeah, in, in what? Emergencies. Oh my and god. And you made them capable of self-replication. Limited, self-manufacture, controlled. Not anymore. No. The glitch severed chain of command. The only nation this swarm answers to now is itself. What? You, you think I did? Everything else is just food. And at the rate it's replicating, Ted, it will strip the Earth bare in 15 months. We're not talking fall of civilization. We're talking extinction. I get it, Liz. So how do I stop it while it's contained? It's not contained. It can't be. You know what I mean. Right. Before the truth gets out, you mean. Liz, I will do anything you say. Keep working it, and whatever you recommend, I'll do. I'm gonna hold you to that, Ted. The Faro robots threatened all life on Earth, but somehow she defeated them. The world of the Old Ones fell, but life went on, or we wouldn't be here. A final plan has been recovered. Project Zero Dawn. Zero Jesus Dawn, was. oh man. There has to be another way. If there are a nicer way to fix your mess, I would have proposed it. But this? This? When I asked you to find a cure, I didn't expect it to be worse than the disease. It's not, Ted. It may be grim, but it's our only chance. Now sign the proposal. 
Sign it? I can't sign that. Yes, you can. That? Liz, I cannot in good conscience sign that. You've got a choice, Ted. I know. I'm speaking to you from a VTOL en route to U.S. Robot Command. In 15 minutes, I meet with General Harris and the rest of the Joint Chiefs. What? What? Are you crazy? Now your choice is what I tell them. Sign, and I'll tell them the wealthiest corporation on Earth has guaranteed the funds necessary to build Zero Dawn. Exactly as I've designed it. Or don't sign, and I will make sure they and everyone else on this planet knows the real cause of the glitch. Yeah. Jesus, Liz. You don't have to threaten me. Apparently she does. I'll sign. Look on the bright side, Ted. From here on out, you get to do what you've always been good at. Footing the bill while others get their hands dirty. Ooh. God forgive me. What made her solution so terrible? Yep. What did she do to stop the robots? Executive access detected. Express and let's this, this doesn't add up. Sobek couldn't have been my mother. She lived ages ago. All this searching and I'm still no closer. If that's your reaction to everything you've just learned? To whine like a spoiled child? You should really try talking that way to me face to face. As you wish. Oh. Do you really have no idea? How monumental are the discoveries you just made, Aloy? I expected more of you. Damn. So, you have a face. Got a name to go with it? Of all the questions you could ask right now, that's the one you choose. I've spent decades searching the ruins of the old ones, trying to solve the mystery of what happened to them. For years, I've suspected that Thero robots destroyed their civilization, but I could never confirm it. And in minutes, you uncover more ancient knowledge than I have in a lifetime, and what you want to know is my name. Silence. That's my name. Now, why don't you try asking another question? Something less trivial. You don't understand. No. I see his point. All right, Silence. You've made your point. I came to these ruins hoping to learn more about this Elizabeth Sobek. And I have, but I still don't understand my connection to her. Or why the Eclipse is trying to kill me. Or who Hades is. No answers, just one question after another. Exactly. Which is why it's time to expand your frame of inquiry. Only then will you see just how big your problems really are. What exactly are you talking about? You've chased a personal riddle into a crowd of larger mysteries. The common thread is your connection to Elizabeth Subic. But what is that connection? She couldn't have been my mother if she lived centuries ago. We don't know the connection yet. The only way to find out is to keep going, to keep making discoveries. Thanks to you, We've only just now learned that Pharaoh robots once threatened to end life on Earth. But it didn't happen. The Old One's civilization was destroyed, but life... life was saved. Obviously. So... What did Elizabeth do? How did she stop the robots before all was lost? What was Project Zero Dawn? Exactly the question. Now... Are you ready to go get the answer? Yeah. Of course I am. Then why are you still standing here? Oh my god. Not so fast, Silence. You've got some explaining to, got do. Some explaining to do. I've told you quite enough. If you've still got questions, be quick about it and stop wasting my time. Oh, we got lots of questions. You said you've known for some time that Faro War Machines destroyed the civilization of the Old Ones. The evidence pointed that way. But until now, I never knew the full scope of their danger. 
that they could process organic matter into fuel, or that the Horus class could manufacture more robots. Like a cauldron on legs. But the robots we've seen so far, the Corruptors and Deathbringers, they don't do those things. Not yet, anyway. So far, we haven't encountered any that are undamaged. At full power, who knows what they're capable of. Now, if that's enough talking, be on your way. No, no. Oh, no. I'm just getting started. You've been getting a free ride on my focus, risking nothing while I risk everything. All I have to do is take this thing off my head, and you'll be blind, deaf, and dumb. So quit complaining and answer my questions. Yeah, also, yeah, why are you spying well. through my focus? Proceed. So far as I can tell, the Eclipse are just following orders. It's Hades who wants me dead. Who is he? I don't know. The Eclipse describe him as a buried shadow, hmm. some kind of devil. Weird. That thing that spoke to me outside, that made that focus explode. That was Hades. It, it didn't seem like a person or a machine. More like a phantom. With a terrible voice. All that's certain is that he wants you dead. Dead. Because of my connection to Elizabeth. Has to be. Hades is using the Eclipse to resurrect feral robots. But if Elizabeth found a way to stop them centuries ago, if she made special weapons, maybe Hades is worried I'll do the same thing. In some of the ancient data I've recovered, there are hints of so-called super weapons being developed. Maybe to stop the robots, the civilization of the old ones had to destroy itself. Who are you, Silence? And what are your intentions? Who? You really oh, need to make this personal? Yeah. I'm a lone wanderer who left his tribe behind a long time ago. An explorer of forbidden places, a searcher of lost knowledge. Exactly as I said. Why do you know so much about the Eclipse? I happen to know a lot about a lot of things. I am nothing oh. if not independent. I didn't skip that. Dang it. You've been using my focus to spy on me. How is that possible? Every focus emits a signal, a voice, that only other focuses can hear. I know how to string those voices together, how to make them talk to each other, to communicate, even over vast distances. How do you learn to do that? Years of study and experimentation. In principle, it's not so different from how you override machines. I override focuses. And you can spy through other Eclipse's focuses, too. Usually. All I'll say is that overriding the connections is... Complicated. Okay. Is there any chance that Elizabeth Sobek could still be alive somehow? It's highly unlikely, but not impossible. Some of the ancient data I've recovered includes mentions of life extension techniques. Pharmaceuticals, mostly, an ancient word for medicine. But some were still trying to perfect ways of freezing and unfreezing people. Freezing and unfreezing people? Cryogenics, they called it. But there were problems with it. Given Elizabeth's technological acumen, I can't definitively rule out that she found a way to make herself immortal. <laughs> but this is speculation. Wasting time. Elizabeth told Ted Faro she was headed for a place called U.S. Robot Command to tell people about Zero Dawn. The place still exists. As a ruin. The Asaram call it the Grave Horde. Grave Horde? Cheery name. You'll find it in the Eastern Mountains, buried under the tangled coils of a metal devil, or a BOR 7 Horus, rather, as we're learning to call them. I'll contact you when you get there. Great. I can't wait. Oh, no. Someday we'll meet in person, and your manners had better be improved. Yeah. Tell him, Aloy. Increased concentration time. Yeah. That's right. 
Well, we got a lot of story in that one, y'all. That was a lot. That was a lot. We still have a lot of questions, but we got a lot of answers. Like any good story, right? It actually answers a lot of your questions. You're like, oh, 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 yeah, that makes sense. Okay, well, yeah. Getting but down then, will be a lot faster than getting up here, at least. The question U.S. robot just... command next. Keep All coming. Of zero dawn. Whee! Now, what I want to know is how her hands don't hurt repelling down like that. There should be some serious rope burn. All right, I need to get to the bottom, take a quick break. Where's my borsa? Huh? On his blanket. Him's had a hard day. It's cold. Him's had a real, a real, real hard day. I'm gonna leave it up in case he comes back. He might come back in a minute. Um, oops. Let's get to the bottom. Quick break, and then more gaming. Oh yeah. Whee! She's so raging calm, and I say this, if you know the answer to this, please do not spoil, because I don't remember, and I don't what? That was not. I don't remember Tasty. what the actual an answer was, but. Oh, you bastard. I think it could be maybe like you said. Oh my god, you should be dead. Oh my god, I got it. Uh. Alia was frozen. I mean, mate, I feel like I would, I would lean, I mean, it's possible, right? He's saying can't rule it out, so it's reasonable. But I think it would be more likely that, like, Elizabeth Sobek's DNA was stored, and at a certain time, the machine was meant to, like, I don't know, like, kick out a baby, like a lab baby. I could see those being grown, and you know what I mean? And then... That's how that happens. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe not. But. Or maybe she was frozen as a baby and they just thawed her out a few thousand years later. Um, again, if you know the answer, please don't just be like, don't you remember it's this? Please don't do that. Please. Please. Let us have fun speculating while we. While we play the game and enjoy. You know? Let's go to this vantage point, then I'll take a break. Break, take a 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 break. No, it's not that bad yet. But I, need, I do need to take a break. Yeah. Get in there. Yeah. Why can't you go? Yeah. Oh, boo. Boo, I should be able to fit through that. Boo. Boo. I'm judging you, game. I'm judging you. I can't get through there. It won't let me. Won't let me do it. How do I do it? How do I get out? Mm. Oh, I know what to do. I gotta go this way. This is this is how I why I had a hard time getting in. Cause I didn't realize there was lit literally only one way in and out. A clone type of thing, right? <laughs> right. Cause a clone wouldn't know that they're the person. You would literally just look like them and. You know, <laughs> like biologically be like them, but you aren't them. It's kind of a crazy concept. <laughs> there was a vantage point up here I wanted to get. Cause it's kind of usually a fun thing. <laughs> Take a break, man. A shell walker. Those are hard. Those are tough. Ooh. 
I need a... Uh... Cover. Nope. Get out of here, turkey. He's okay. Die, turkey. Oh, what? That is bad. That is not good. That is problematic as F right there. Jesus. Um, where's the thing where it shows me how to climb up there? Oh, wait. You. Can I climb? Wait. Wait, that's a rappel down. That's got to be a rappel down right there. Ouch. the creases. Yeah! No. That's not it. Yeah! No. Nope. Nope. Anything? They're angry. Oh god. Oh boy. Oh hello. Oh lord. Oh god. Hi. Angry. Angry bird. this guy first. something. Jesus. Why can't I grab anything? Why are there no rock handholds on this son of a bitch? Huh? Nothing. No! You son of a bitch! I'm angry now. I'm angry. I'm angry. Angry! I'm all the way back here. Fine. I won't go. I don't care. <sighs> Pitch cliff. Oh yeah, this was Aaron and his sister. We'll do this now. But we're gonna go over here first. Yep, this is perfect. This is perfect. <sighs> ah, I know. I know! I need Borsa Snuggles and some chocolate. Mushroom chocolate. That'll make me feel better. Enjoy the nice soothing sounds of the uh, sawtooth. I uh, just saw two. They're fine. They won't get me over here. They're fine. Okay, I'll be right back, guys. Don't go anywhere. Leave a like on the video, and thanks for hanging out.
I'm back, everyone. Thank you for waiting. Or thank you for arriving if you just got here. Wait, how's this open? I'm angry or angry or hangry. Either hangry or angry. Why would I be either? I'm neither. I'm actually neither. I'm eating chocolate. Mushroom chocolate. The mushrooms are. Reishi, Lion's Mane, Chaga, Cordyceps, Shiitake, Maitake, Tramella, and Turkey Tail. I've heard Turkey Tail uh, curing cancer. Or like treating, not curing it, but like treating it. Oh, that was some really good chocolate. And I would never in a million years guess that it had mushrooms in it. Never. It tastes like good dark chocolate. Yum. Funny fact. First time I ever knew about reishi mushrooms, it was because of the long dark video games. Oh no. Okay. And look who's back. Mm-hmm. Okay. Here we go. Hello, Frank. Stocking up. Hmm. That is good chocolate. Like, actually good chocolate. Not like, uh, it's good for me chocolate. If you sold this to me as, like, fancy dark chocolate, I would believe you. I'd be like, mmm, I can tell. It is delicious. Boy, you gotta get cozy. Gotta get snuggled in. Gotta get cozy. Gotta get snuggled in. That boy is cozy. There we go. Oh, useful. Yeah, I'll say. I'm so low on berries. Eat the berries. So, yeah. Let's clear a corrupted zone, I guess.
name. Alright, hold on. I should do virtual meet and greets with Orson. Just be like, free increase to your dopamine. Sign up here. Guaranteed. Look at that boy. close to doing this actually.
so close to doing this. Oh my god. Oh my god, I think I'm gonna do it. had killed me, I'd have been so upset, y'all. <sighs> wow, what a freaking battle, dude. Oh, and we got we got snap balls down here, y'all. This is bad. What are you? Are you all catch on fire, guys? Mushroom chocolate, y'all. I'm telling you. I'm gonna be sad when that's gone. I need to get more. these for the trail. You really need to reframe how you look at mushrooms. High five. They are far more expensive than just like the little button ones you had to eat like <laughs> as a kid or something. Okay, no more sneaking. Oops. Shit. Okay. <sighs> oh fucking hell.
damn. Jesus. Lord mercy. God. Just like, they're not supposed to be that difficult, and then they are. Yikes. Mushroom chocolate. Yeah, it's... Listen. Reishi, lines mean chaga, cordyceps, shiitake, mataki, tremella, and turkey tail. Delicious. Like, so good. Good for no I got hardly any health potions now. Just as he, just as I'm adjusting the camera, the boy goes. Listen, I don't need to see any more research that tells me that certain types of mushrooms can help prevent diseases like dementia, Alzheimer's, some types of cancer. Um, basically, all like every disease. For every type of disease, I would almost venture to say that there is a type of mushroom that there is research that supports that it is at least helpful against it. Um, if not outright uh, curing it or removing it or healing it, it's there's so much. I defy anyone to watch the, the Fantastic Fungi documentary and tell me that you do not look at mushrooms differently. There are so many, so many there's so many stories of people that were like, I tried turkey tail mushrooms at the end of my cancer treatment, the chemo was killing me, and then my cancer went away. And I'm like, well, that's crazy, that's wild. They have research that says how the, the, our brain cells, that they said you can't regrow. Remember when they were like, in school, when like the, the, when the dare guy came and he was like, once you lose those brain cells, they're gone forever, they don't ever come back. We thought that until certain types of mushrooms uh, showed that you can. You can actually regrow them. Like neurons came back to life. That is insane. So I want that. I, after I watch that, I'm like, I want to include that in my diet. I need mushrooms in my diet. They've evolved alongside us. Uh, they've evolved in such a way that I think they are literally designed to help us um, and or kill us if we eat the wrong ones. But a lot of them are designed to kill it, or to help us, not kill us. So, it's just, listen, I want my brain to be healthy. I want my body to be healthy. I, I want to resist, not resist, but um, reduce that kind of wear and tear on my body. body. That's, a bit, that's a better word. Reduce the wear and tear. I am not talking about, guys, there are more, y'all. Do y'all only know magic mushrooms? Does, if you say mushroom, do you only think of magic mushrooms? Or like sauteed mushrooms in a pan? Those are like the only two. There's so many mushrooms. So many. So many. And they are discovering more all the time. 
Like, so many. Educate yourself. We need to be friends of fungi here. If they're fucking curing cancer and stuff, I would venture to still call those magic mushrooms. Regrowing brain neurons? Yeah, I'll call that a magic mushroom. Pretty freaking magical. Also, it is a disservice to mushrooms to say, oh, they, the magic mushrooms to say, oh, they just get you high. That is not what they do. And I feel it is something you need to experience before you can speak on it with any sort of authority. Ahem. But no, I read off the list of, of like mushrooms that are in the chocolate. They are, you can get them in basically any form, over the counter, anywhere. You can order them off the internet. Reishi, Lion's Mane, Chaga, Cordyceps, Shiitake. Shiitake, you can go to the freaking grocery store and get Shiitake mushrooms. Like, now my Taki, never heard, never seen those. Tremelon, and Turkey Tail. Turkey Tail's the one that was curing cancer. I think I'll eat some. I think I'll have some, thanks. I would like some of that. Yes, please. Hey, we found this mushroom that cures cancer. Do you want any of it? Nah. Those just get you high, right? No, I'll take them, please. Uh, we have it in chocolate form. Oh my god, even better. <laughs> like, holy shit. Uh, I'm not gonna say no to that. Hey, we found a city, yay. Mushroom rant, over. I'm saving this last little bit of chocolate for my sister. No sign of Marat's guy. He's had plenty of time to investigate. We'd better look for him. Damn right. Hope everything's in order for you. Okay. That was brief. That was very brief. Errand. Hello. Is this all we're doing? We're just like hello. Okay. Pitch cliff. Okay. range bolt gun there are mushrooms that go well with bacon and green beans that's true also yeah and not all of them are medicinal they also some of them just taste good they actually just taste good and go go well with things Desperately needed to go to town and get supplies. Watch Fantastic Fungi, Queens. It's a documentary. And I watched it back in like October of last year. 
It was amazing. I ordered my mushroom box full of like mushroom. And I think what it was is it kept saying like the supply chain is broken, deliveries are broken. And it's like a box of a bunch of different products that the, that the people, the mushroom people, they have like the mushroom, you know, they're like, they're like friends of fungi, right? They help promote research and awareness of these things because they, there are lots of ways to get mushrooms in your diet that involve like, or that don't involve like eating actual mushrooms. Uh, you know, that's not like a, like a mushroom, like a actual mushroom. You can have it as a chocolate. I have, I've got uh, a million other things besides the tea that I made, delicious. The tea was very good, I like it. I have a coffee, I have a, a, a like a creamer thing. I have a, a, what was it? There's like a bunch of stuff. There's like these little capsules. There was gummies mushroom gummies that you could just get. and it was all like it's all for your brain it's all in your body and just your organs and it's like dear god after watching that documentary and seeing all of the things that we have actual science to support how good they are for us I'm like you don't need to tell me twice man I always liked mushrooms and would always opt to add them to things pizza or whatever like I like them but I had no idea that it went that deep I really didn't Fungi.com. Yep. And then I went to, was it shop? Yep. Yeah! 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 This is the one! This is the owl box! Yeah! Go to fantasticfungi.com. Go to shop. The forager box. I watched the documentary. It was like, if you're interested in more. And there's like books and seminars and workshops and all of this stuff to like educate people about how amazing mushrooms are for us and how to like where where and which ones to get and for what and how to add them into your diet or whatever and like all of these amazing you know tools to just help people be healthier and you know I really and it was like this box was basically like hey here's a grab bag of some of our favorite things to try to sample and I was like I want to try that and man I was not disappointed at all I need to try this rope caster thing. It ties down the the creatures, which is kind of cool, you know? Pretty cool. But then again, let me look at this boo. The boo. Fire, fire, damage. Fire, fire, damage. Fire, 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 fire. Um, Tripacasta. Let's see. Damn! 
The shock is like outrageous. My, my trip caster is for shocks, and that's pretty much it. Handling, handling. Sling is pretty much for cold. Yeah, that's kind of how you have to do it. Freeze, freeze, freeze. Yeah, that's kind of how you have to do it. Shock, cold, my bow is fire, among other things. This rope thingy, though, now that's a different thing altogether, you know. I'm pretty- you can get all the products other places, uh, Mr. EMJ. I just don't know. I would have to go look and see what the brand of it was. Um, I may put it on my story or something later, because I'm really- so far the quality of the product- sometimes when you do that, it's kind of a- you kind of get ripped off. And I'm not sa I'm not sampled everything in the box, but what I went through, for one, I got a ton of stuff. Like a ton, and the stuff I've tried has been really good so far. Like, very pleased with my selection thus far. Very, very pleased. Alright, we got a badass rope caster as well. This works. Sell this. Oops. Mm -hmm. Okay. What we got. What am I looking for, brother? This guy right here. Well, someone left here recently, and they were in a hurry. Got a trail. Mushroom jerky? Yeah, I saw that. I don't know, man. I'd be re I'm real skeptical of mushroom jerky, but I'm gonna try it. Has to be Marat's guy. Durval's thugs must have made him. Maybe because he found something. Look at this. I think he drew a map with his own blood. Right. Damn. Those kind of maps you know you better follow. She <laughs> might be Pitchcliff. He marked a spot to the north. Could be Derval's location. And my men are waiting outside of town. I'll grab them and meet you there. She's like, are you okay? Well, that was fast. Let's go. Oh, it's out. I'm telling you. I ordered it. I waited forever, and then they were like, we were having supply issues, we are having, like, we are so, like, they were so apologetic, and I thought, I'm never gonna get this thing, never gonna get it. And then I understand why now, they were having such a hard time getting it, but I bet you're right, I bet they got, they sold them all, and people are like, uh, we need more of those, so, definitely keep an eye out. That website is great, the documentary is great, uh, it's amazing. <laughs> I'm like, wow, like, what a gift. Something that just grows here. We can just grow it. And it 
helps us, takes care of us so much. It's kind of amazing. There's anywhere to how to get out of here. Although this is help helpful, I'll have to let you know how the jerky is, Queens. I gotta be in the right mood for that one, though. Oh. Okay. Well, that is quite a ways out of town. But that's fine. Cause we're gonna go here. Oh my god, I can't hit anything. Oh my god, I'm the worst. I'm the worst. The worst archer ever. This old last. your herd you failed sir god dang ow that hurt oof oof haha <laughs> loser oh my god I blew up all these guys look at this amazing Amazing. I think I'm in the clear. Oh, I'm you're definitely not in the clear. Definitely not in the clear. That's a big thing. That's a big flying thing there. That's bad. That is not good. Nope. Nope. Not good. Not good at all. I don't have very much healing either. Ah, that's not true. That's not true. Actually, I've got quite a bit. I'm fine. Hmm. Yeah. Not good. Not good. Not good. Okay. 
Stormbird. Where you at? Where you at, bird? Derv, who's Dervil? I'm with you, Queens. I think I take it as a good sign. I waited a long time to get that one. And it was worth it. All right, we killing stuff. What the hell? That's messed up. Machines. Looks like they've been chained up. Durval's a tinker. He probably experiments on them or, or strips them for parts. Maybe I can use them to make some trouble. I'll go in first. Hold off until the fighting starts. All right. Always. We've got your back. Find out. Oh, bah. Yes, I can. Oh, my God, it hit the freaking stick right in front of him. That's such men. shit. It's about to get ugly. I hope so. That is such shit. Loose it. Set the demon free. Set the demon free. We've got a quake. Ah! Oh, good lord, help me! Yeah, y'all deserve this. Bomb. That works pretty good, actually. Hey. 
Nah, you're as good as dead. Shut up. Ah! <laughs> what? Yeah, are you kidding me, dude? Oh my god. Well, at least I get a chance to do it again more stealthy like. God. I do how do I set them free Oh, 
Where'd you come from? Back up. Ay, ay, ay. Done yet? Don't get excited. Can you convert the machines eventually? Here. There, what? There, yeah, 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 quite proud of it. Oh, hello. Woo! I did it! That was it! Oh man, okay. What's over here? Come on, Aaron. Let's get your sister. Where's your sister? <laughs> Hello? 
know. Your oh, vow says you've got to eat dirt. Excuse me? Let's do this. God, Aaron, you may want to pull up, bruh. Oh god. Oh no. to get through get her oh give me a focus give me something good they must use these to protect themselves from that awful sound yep going on only a little bit just trying to get done uh, finish this quest I just wanted to, you know, see what was what was down here. Uh-oh. Ursa. Oh, damn. What a horrible way to go. Or not go. I mean, she may not be dead, but damn. No, she's dead. No, she's not. Aaron? Durval tried to break me. Damn, girl. Shows what he knows. I, sh I should have been with you. Aww. Why didn't you come for me? I, I know I'm a useless trunk, but... No, idiot. I got a message from Durval saying he wanted to parlay. I didn't come for you because I knew it was a trap. I couldn't let you get hurt. Just didn't think it'd be that good a trap. Thought I could take him out. <laughs> oh no, she gonna die. <coughs> no. Now listen. Durval's planning something big in Meridian. He said he'd force Avad to watch as the smoke darkens their precious sun. Your king needs you. No more playing around. You're gonna have to grow up fast. I, I will. I promise. You Dang. damn well better, little brother. Oh, no. Ursa. No, no. Please. <laughs> I won't let you down. I promise. Except for when I need to sit you down. Just this last time. <laughs> oh, that's sad. I'm so sorry. You've got to find Durval. We got to do it. But Meridian's a big place. I'll, uh, I'll look through his things. Maybe we can narrow it down. Good shot. Just notes about crafting. Ooh. And a letter tucked between the pages. Lots of blaze. Headed to Meridian. What? Wait, what? If we find it, I'll bet we find modifications.
keep a look. Such a strange device. It's beautifully crafted. This machine's been picked apart with precision. I think I found something that can help. Let's head back to the palace. Go. Go. I won't be long, but I need to tend to my sister. It's understandable. All right, that's what I wanted. Will, will it show me where the freaking palaces so I can get back to it. That'd be great. Uh, show on map. Oh, there it is! Uh, ah, it's in the middle of all that, of course, of course. How silly of me. Specialty. Yeah, man, I should have, uh, where's the flower artifact? That's the one. Go here. I got some stuff to trade in real quick, y'all. Good night, Emma. Lurk mode, then off to bed. I'm glad you enjoyed the stream. And thank you for being so kind, Emma. Appreciate you. Remember when I was looking and looking and looking and could not find the the palace? I'm like, what? I tried some new incense tonight as well, and I gotta say. This has been a good night for trying things. The mushroom tea, the mushroom chocolate, the new incense. I'm just really happy with everything. Are you the cup guy, lady? Back from the wilds. No, Banooks, no, wait, let me see. You ready? You ready? Wait, uh? Nope. Goodbye. Come on back if you find any. Excuse me, Goodbye. Outlander. What I'm looking you? for Banuk Art. Are you? Wait. What? No, you're not the one. Where's the mystery boxes? Vessel? Is it vessel? Is it the Vesselman? Vesselman? Mr. Vesselman? Hello, Mr. Vesselman. Let's try it. Hmm, yes. Mm, yes. I remember. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Of course, of course. Ah, I can get one! Oh, thank you. I will leave you. Perhaps your travels have taken you through like ancient you. ruins. Let us speak. Mm -hmm. Last one. Children in video games freak me out. Even when they're just random NPCs, I'm like, Ah, oh, you're back. Ah, trade. Ah. Eh? Huh? No. Damn. Ten. Jesus! So hard to get. Till we meet again. I have a matter of grace and That's beauty. Great. I would like to just. So much stuff. Yeah. Okay. Yikes. I'm killing it right now. Combat override. Yeah. The the over. I gotta improve my override for sure. That's gotta be on the list of things to do. Next. 
texts. It's fine. So, save. Okay, perfect. We did a lot today. We accomplished a lot. We rescued Aaron. Well, we did rescue Aaron's sister. She just died immediately after. But more importantly, we discovered a lot of secrets about what happened to this world. You know, what Elizabeth Sobek's part in all of that was. We don't know anything more about really Aloy's connection with her. Um, but there was, you know, there was a lot revealed. Hey, Philip Byron, how have things been in the new space? Have you seen Mortal Engines? It was better than I was told. I have not seen Mortal Engines. I don't even know what that is. I'll check it out, though. Things in the new space are amazing. It's coming along swimmingly, and could not be happier. Mr. Borson is enjoying his beanbag area over here, and has been a good boy. That's why his bed is empty. It's hard when you got a new beanbag. I understand. Uh, but otherwise, things are good, Philip. Other than I'm getting ready to uh, wrap up my stream. It is a little later than normal, but I'll still be in bed by 10, 10 p.m., so I'm happy about that. Um, but I appreciate the support, man. I really do. So, I am going to wrap this up here, though. This is, this is the right place, okay? It's been a great stream. I do appreciate you all. I look forward to streaming again tomorrow. That is the plan. Um, I'd like to sometime this week perhaps bring a special stream to, uh, to you guys. Maybe some phasmophobia with friends type of thing. Uh, we'll see, all right? We're bouncing some ideas around. We'd like to do it, but uh, but stay stay tuned, okay? And uh, if not, it'll just be me here streaming Horizon like usual. All right, I gotta beat this before the next one comes out. So have a wonderful evening, everybody. Thank you for your support and for hanging out. I really do enjoy it and appreciate you guys being here. It's nice to stream and, and share it with you guys. So Philip, ah, oh, oh, Philip, thank you. You did not you did not need to do that as I'm sure you know but you did it and I appreciate it I hope you have a wonderful night my friend take care everyone Queens C and Pep Sabretooth Tie 5 Loco J children in real life freak me out I understand man I do um, take care guys play a among us some an amogus throwback wouldn't that be something who knows stay tuned uh, remember to subscribe if you haven't done that yet. Stay hydrated. Oh, Mr. Borson Borson, look, he came back. I got the best boy. So good. So good. All right. I'm out of here, guys. Take care. And, uh, oh, yeah, stay hydrated.